interesting about this is it mixes just a whole bunch of different worlds together. So you're dealing with the medieval time period, which has to do with accessibility of materials and tools, how we didn't have stores to go buy these inks in, and then also the magical properties that come with these, because we are also dealing with thoughts of alchemy, transforming things, all of that. So this section here is going to be on the Gull ink, and then we're going to do an India ink, which I've added. Yes, bonus, thank you. We're gonna be doing the India ink and the Gall ink. And those are gonna be two variations of two different styles of inks that you can make at home with most of the supplies that you have. We do have a kit that you can purchase that has ink kits together, which I've upgraded. I have been debating whether or not I wanted to do just the one ink that we normally did in class here, but I also wanted to give you more of that medieval manuscript style Gall ink.